Before we start the video, I'd like to give a shout out to Robert Gonzalez for giving me the idea for this theory. Go check his channel out if you haven't already, and without further ado, let's start the video. Would you believe me if I told you that everyone in Bikini Bottom died, and the only reason there's anyone alive today is because of divine intervention? Let me explain. You might think that this is a pretty hard theory to believe, but if you watch this one clip from the episode The Main Drain, your mind will change. Let's take a look. What we just witnessed was everyone in Bikini Bottom dying. But you may be thinking, since Mr. Krabs and Plankton were kids in this scene, how are they alive in the show, and how is anyone else alive for that matter, since Bikini Bottom was completely wiped out, like 50 years before the show starts? To answer that question, let me introduce you to the former man, the myth, the legend, the Flying Dutchman. If you don't know, the Flying Dutchman is basically the god of Bikini Bottom, and he has lots of powers, one of which is being able to grant wishes. It could be possible that the reason that everyone is still alive in the show is because somebody wished that Bikini Bottom came back. Another reason I think that the Flying Dutchman brought them back is because in the episode Born Again Krabs, it's shown that Mr. Krabs is taken to Davy Jones's locker for, quote, being cheap. Do you really think that that would be the only reason that the Flying Dutchman would take him there? Or do you think he might know about this incident that happened when Mr. Krabs was a child? If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like and subscribe to this channel and check out my other Spongebob theories. Also, if you want to see any Spongebob theories, just leave a comment and I'll try to use it. And if you get mad, just remember, none of this is canon, so just relax.